In this video I am going to show you how you can easily turn off stolen device protection on your iPhone. Be sure to watch the video to the very end so you don't make any mistakes. Let's get started guys and uh, stolen device protection helps us to protect our device if it is let's say stolen but if you don't need it you can easily disable it as well. First off, guys, I'm gonna show you how it works. So, let's say now I stole this device and I would like to change this device's passcode. passcode. Let's say I stole it uh, from my friend and I know the old passcode, so now I can enter um, Face ID and Passcode menu. I know the old... Oh, sorry guys. I know the old one. And here by tapping at change passcode, I'm going to change it. However, when stolen device protection is enabled, we can hit right here at change passcode. However, it says that security delay required to change this passcode and uh, this security delay will last for one hour and you will still be able to use your phone during this delay. However, turning off or restarting your iPhone will restart the delay. And that may help you in the situations when someone knows your password and that will prevent them from changing it. Now guys, I'm gonna show you how we can easily turn it off. I'm gonna show you the entire process from the beginning. So guys, first off we need to head over to settings. After that we need to go to the face ID and passcode. The menu where we were before. And then right here just keep scrolling down until you find it here. Uh, here it is, stolen device protection. It is currently enabled. And in here, first off, we can configure it a bit. We can uh, switch it, let's say, from always to away from familiar locations. So the option will be activated just when you are away from your familiar locations. And also by toggling it off, we can easily turn off the entire feature. However, when the first time we are trying to change the setting or when we are trying to turn it off, it will show us the same pop-up where we need to tap at start security delay and now here it says time remaining and here we got this uh, timer for one hour now uh, it says here that we'll get a notification when the security delay ends and uh, then we'll be able to make changes to the stolen device protection. Now I'm just gonna hit add done and then we need to go back here after an hour and then we'll be able to change that option and also we'll be able to turn this feature off. Basically guys, that's it. So if this video was helpful for you, don't forget to hit the like button.